Greetings, one and all. Welcome back to the RP Geeks. I'm Sam Grayson, and it is time for more Pokemon Violet. More specifically, we're making our way to the Pokemon League. Team Star has been dealt with. We've rescued Mabostiff and taken on a request from Professor Turo to go to Area Zero. To do so, we'll need help from one more person. To get that one more person to help us, we need to not battle the Sigley buff. We need to take on the Pokemon League. Which, excuse me, which hopefully I'm in a position to do. Wrong with one last heal up. I should be good to go. Hopefully. Maybe. Potentially. There's Gita. Hi. Hello, Sammy. So this is it. You decided to face the Pokemon League. The final test you must pass to become a champion is held here in this building. I wish you the best of luck from the bottom of my heart, Sammy. I look forward to meeting you again soon. Hello. Are you ready to face the Pokemon League's champion assessment? Yeah. Let's see here. Semi from Uva Academy, is it? It appears you have a total of eight gym badges. Very well. You may now proceed to the interview room. Oh, hey, it's Rika. Thank you for coming today. Please, do have a seat. I, Rika, will be your interviewer. Let's get started with the first portion of the champion assessment. We begin with the interview. First things first, let me see how many gym badges you have. Excellent, you have all eight. Next, I'd like to ask you a few questions, if you wouldn't mind, Sammy. Please think carefully, as you may automatically fail the interview, depending on your answers. Let's begin. How did you get here today? I wrote on my Pokemon. Very good, very good. You tell me the name of the school you were enrolled in. Naranja Academy. I think that's the one from Scarlet. Uva Academy. Ah, that's right. So what brings you to the Pokemon League today? Game to become a champion. Yes, indeed. Why else would you be here, I suppose? And what do you intend to do if and when you become a champion? What to battle Nimona? Become even stronger. I see. Interesting. Tell me, which of the eight gyms give you the most difficulty? Uh, do we go with Larry or do we go with Grusha? I'm going to say Larry. The gym leader you faced there. He did stomp my shit in pretty hard. Which type of Pokemon? It's normal. Wonderful. Building the skills needed for the champion assessment is no small feat. It's met a lot of Pokemon to get here, Sammy. What was the category of the Pokemon you chose to be your first partner? The Fire Croc Pokemon. Caliente. Very good, very good. 
Now, please forgive me, but I'm going to repeat a previous question. Remind me, what do you intend to do if and when you become a champion? Or to become even stronger? Ah, yes, that's right. Next is the final question for this interview. Do you like Pokemon, Sammy? Of course. <laughs> Just no. No! Good job, kiddo. That about wraps up the interview. Let me be the first to congratulate you, Sammy. You just passed the first part of the champion assessment. Yay! On your first try, too, no less. Don't think anyone's done that since Nimona. But anyway, time to switch gears and get ready for the next segment. Segment is what we call the Elite Test. Where we face off against the Elite Four. In Pokemon battles. Because that's pretty obvious from the name of the test, huh? Anyway, we're the best the league has to offer. They'll be facing us four in a row. No turning back. It'll be a cakewalk, I promise you that. But you're all ready to go, then go into the room behind me. Okay. That is not the right button. Can I just say I'm kind of scared right now because I'm walking into this having zero idea of what types I'm up against. Like, there's not even fancy design in the room to tell me a single goddamn thing. I don't think I've seen any of their Pokemon either. So I have no idea what I'm up against. Now then, let's get this started, eh? Let good old Rika be the first of the Elite Four to take you on. I'd say I'll go easy on you, but... I'd be lying. Think fast. Whisk cache, eh? So we're either going water or ground. Finally get to battle you. I'm looking forward to this, so don't you give up too soon. Either way... Delfino is definitely not who I want up front for this. Let's see. Water ground. Definitely want oil out for this. Earth power. That was indeed the correct choice. Let's hit Petal Day and see what happens. Oh, he's got Blizzard. Foon. All right, who's next? Camera up. Yes, I would like to switch out, please. Delfino, you're up. You're starting to look like ground type. It's a camera up. It is ground type. Rika is a ground type trainer. Camera up is ground, right? Or is it rock? Pretty sure it's ground. Leave a crash. Oh, that was a crit, too. What's next? Dawn Fan. Keep up the crashing. Oh, fucking sturdy, god damn it.
Okay, Jet Punch. Goodbye. Yay, level. And no more healing. What's next? Dark Trio. Let's keep going. Uh, let's go with the Jet Punch this time. That was indeed enough. Claude Sire. Nope. <laughs> Impressive. Really are something else, kiddo. I think it's time to terastalize. I probably should have saved that. Because I don't think it recharges. Is it going to recharge between fights? Probably not. I probably just wasted this. You bastard. Motherfucker. I did waste it. Gonna use Earthquake. If it lives, I'm gonna heal it. Okay. Max Pusion. Okay. Try an Ice Punch instead. There we go. One more hit. Bitch. There we go. Claude. Yay! I didn't lose anybody. <laughs> Not bad, kiddo. <laughs> she don't look too happy. She's like, okay, okay. Talk about unfair. No way was I ever going to win that one. Still, though, what a great battle. Felt good to even to lose. Not a whole lot of trainers have the skill to make it past the elite test. But who knows? I'm beginning to think you might be one of the few that do, Sammy. They're staying on your toes, though. Secondly, the Elite Four is stronger than me. You're up next, Squirt. Come on out. Coming. Oh. Oh, wow. Did you lose, Rika? Yeah, I did. She's no pushover, let me tell you. Be watching from the side. Avenge me if you can, eh? You bet I will. Ugh. Get rid of that poison. Get rid of the poison. <gasps> Where's that antidote? Here it is. Okay. I don't know what you are, so I'm going to leave it like this. Please, Poppy. Yes.
so cool you made it this far. This is where you say bye-bye, miss. All my Pokemon are super tough. Your weak attacks won't work on them at all. They'll bounce right off, you'll see. Can't wait for you to meet my friends, so here they come. Owned by Poppy of the Elite Four. Steel type. Okay. Go on, Raja, smush him. Well, it's per usual. Let's see. I have options here. I'm gonna go for Tom Caliente or Mr. Paint. I think I'm gonna be on this. I'm gonna play it safe and start with Mr. Pink. My reliable partner, Mr. Pink. Oh, that could be a problem. Aberutiki. Corviknight. Okay, probably should have done this in the first place. I'm gonna switch to Caliente. See how far I can get with Torch Song. Faster. And stronger. All right, basically a free two tier power up. Unless we got like a water type in here or something, I think I'm safe. And up bronze on. Well, I switch. No. God forbid this thing has heat proof. Doesn't look like it does. And a magnetism. Will I switch? No. Damn sturdy. Let me guess, Thunder Wave. Light screen. Ew. And now Tinkaton. Well, I switch. Not if I don't have to. I'm not scared. My last Pokemon will turn things around. Mold Breaker. Oh, I can't terrestrialize. Okay, so it is a once per fight thing. Awesome. I guess time to get dressed up all pretty, Tinky. What they got is steel and not fairy. Otherwise, I might be in trouble. So good to know we do regain use between these battles, at least. About to say, even through light screen, this should be a one hit KO. Woo! Like 
Oh. Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> I wanted to take revenge on you, Rika. Pretty sure you mean take revenge for me, Squirt. I don't think I did anything wrong by you. I hate to say it, but you lost, Poppy. Better call the next guy. Oh, that's right. I haven't had to do this in a long time. Your turn, Mr. Larry. Fucking excuse me. Huh. Hello there. It's me, Larry. Okay, we're up against Larry. I'm going to assume he's using his usual normal types. Which means... Let's see. I actually think... Now let's switch into Kingsley. Let me check everyone's moves real fast. I want to bring Torch Song back up. Not for this fight, but just in general. Okay. Should be golden. Ready to face Larry of the Elite Four. Yes. So you made it this far. I serve as a member of the Elite Four, too. Yes. Unfortunately for me. At my gym, I use normal type Pokemon since I feel they have a lot in common with me. But, well, the boss told me to use a diff... Oh, fuck. So if you have any complaints, please take them up with La Primera. Okay, so he's not using normal types. What is he using, then? Anyway, time to get to work. He's got the gloves on. That's how you know he means business. Okay. Well, I'll be trying my hand with flying type Pokemon this time. Okie dokie means I'm going to want to switch back to Delfino ASAP but foist thank you for the power up Star Raptor, will I switch? I'm going to say yes. Yep. This motherfucker. Ray Burb. Ow. Jet punch ought to do the trick. Yep. Or he pulls any bullshit. And now to Altaria. No. Even with lowered attack. Our sunlight fade. 
or a Koryu. I don't know which one. That would be the electric one, I believe. Which means punch. Ooh, so close. Ow! Yeah, thank God that didn't paralyze me. Oh, I still got some left. Flamigo. You know what? I think I will. Even stronger than before. Guess I don't get a break today. Flamigo fight! Well, that is his last. You know what, let's just straight up have a Flamigo fight. At the risk of messing up my suit a bit, it's time to get some wind on our backs. One hit, hell yeah. Mr. Pink, Mr. Pink, Mr. Pink. Well, that took the wind from under our wings. A lot stronger than I recall. No wonder La Primera likes you. Now then, suppose the final member of the Elite Four is next. It's your turn, Hassel. Now, where could he be? Uh, don't think he heard you, Larry. Come on in, Hassel. Larry, you, you may need to speak up just a bit, little bit more. Hassel. <laughs> Hassel, you're up next. Ah, this guy. Hello there, Sammy. Delights me to see you here. As for you, Larry, so you made Rika do the shouting again, hmm? He's like, yeah. Okay. Get everyone all healed up. Check moves. Don't, shouldn't need to recharge any. This is fine. This punch is fine. We're good to go. Good to go. Good to go. Good to go. Yep. I have no idea what I'm up against, so we'll stick with this. Yeah. I was, of course, absolutely certain you would make it to me eventually. Young Sprouts truly do grow with astounding speed, yes. But I never for a moment imagined we'd be facing each other so soon. Now, a teacher's duty is to guide students and aid their growth. But I think I shall forget about my role as a teacher for a moment. And wield all my might for the sole purpose of defeating you. I am Hassel, the dragon guarding the final fortress of the Elite Test. So he's dragon type. Prepare to learn firsthand how the fiery breath of ferocious battle feels. And me without any fairy moves. No, I probably could have done that between fights. Don't think I'm gonna have to with this first one. Okay. 
Show me everything you've got. I shall face you with my full strength. Okay. Flip turn. Oh, you bitch. Okay, flip turn into Mr. Pink. You turn back in... Spend a turn healing, then you turn back into Delfino. There, Mr. Pink's going down, or I'm getting the switch off. Either way. Alright. Let's ice punch these motherfuckers. God damn, this thing's fast. Ow! Bitch! Drag algae. I'm going to stay. Seen this before. I don't remember what type you are. I'm just going to ice punch you. Okay, thank God. I legit thought it was going to be a water type for a second. And now Flapple. I'm definitely not swapping out. Aw, how cute. And I wish I'd have done that sooner. Yep. You have the other one. Haxorus. Play switch. No. Mold breaker. Aren't these guys supposed to be bigger? Ice punch. Oh, it held in. Jet punch should do the trick. Excalibur. I uh, don't know what that is. Um. See what Tingley can do. A little more until you pass. Don't let up. I haven't fought one of you, right? This is last, so. Let's rationalize and see what Iron Head does. Come, O oh Great Dragon, and take a Terra Jewel as your crown. Yeah, that only did double damage instead of quad damage. Ooh, that still hurt it quite a bit. Yay, I win.
Mighty Dragon has been felled. Y you really did it? Oh, wow. Huh. Yeah, I'm not reading that. Just so proud of you. Aw, oh, he's trying. Aw, oh, don't cry, Grandpa Hassel. There, there. Want a hug? Sorry about all this, Sammy. The old man can get like that sometimes. What if I do? I'm just so overwhelmed. Guess I gotta do the talking. Anyway, your result for the elite test of the champion assessment is... A pass. No doubt about it. Yeah, you're tougher than steel. Yep. Did so beautifully. Congratulations. Say you're good to go, but it's actually just a wee bit more to the champion assessment. This will be your final trial. See the door back there? Our fearless commander, final opponent you'll face for your test, is waiting beyond it. Her skills are so amazing she was able to strong arm all of us into joining the Elite Four. Won't find a mightier champion. Oh, I think you'll do fine, kiddo. Beat me, after all. I'll patch up your team. On the house, so don't lose you here. Really love your Pokemon, miss. So I'll cheer for you as hard as I can. Well, uh, good luck. Even a baby dragon could breathe fire. Whoa, guess you got over your stops, huh? You can do this. We all know you can. Now go, young Sammy. Your hands may be small, but let them seize a great victory. They believe in me. Indeed. Under normal circumstances, I believe champ. Mm. Usually, they have a variety of different types of Pokemon, so I think this is definitely the best way to start. Now, up against the mighty Gita. Here we are. Tippy top of the Pokemon League. Welcome, Sammy. It's me great joy that you managed to make it all the way to the pinnacle of the Pokemon League. Final test is a battle against me, the top champion. To pass, all you need to do is win. But before we get started, I should apologize for one thing. See, I have a trait that some may say is inappropriate for the League chairwoman. I am utterly incapable of holding back when it comes to Pokemon battles. Maybe that's why nobody's passed this test recently. It's a bit of a problem, to be honest. But you, you might manage something wonderful like Champion Nimona did. So, you ready for your final test? I want to see the true measure of your talent. Oh, she gets the fancy gloves. Spathra. Do you hope you can defeat me and become a champion yourself? Purely psychic. Okay. Flip turn. Start with Kingsley. Damn it. Oh, wait. I have Brick Break. Haha. <laughs> One of the rare times I get to use its other effect. Yes, that was the correct decision in the situation. Please continue. All right, who's next? Avalug. I think I'm going to keep him in. I 
Iron Head. Need another round. Oh, it flinched! Yes! This round is mine. Go Goat. Will I switch? Yes. Caliente. It is your time to shine. And for Yield Torch Song. Truly a devastating blow. It deserves a standing ovation. King Gambit. Will I switch? Yes. Mr. Pink, you're up. Will he get speed? No. Here's a thought. Double kick should bypass sturdy, right? Or like any multi-hit move, potentially. The loser. Oil. You're not one to let something so insignificant fluster you. Bitch, I still have my whole team. Yay. Glimora. Don't know what that is, so no. <laughs> Don't think you've won just yet. Be the light that guides all trainers, Glamora. Time for the terrestrializing. You change in two. Rock. Awesome. Thank you for the advantage. From whatever it was before. Or not. Ow! Alright. You know, I was this close to winning without losing any of my Pokemon. Oh well. Time for a wave crash! I win! Toxic debris. I am the champion. Yeah. Go beyond my imagination so easily. Such overwhelming power, such amazing skill. Kings Paldia has gained another wonderful trainer to be proud of. Congratulations. It's my honor to call you champion, Sammy. Congratulations is right. Now I can really say you're good to go. Yay, you did it, miss. Congratulations. <laughs> Ugh, crying again? Pokemon trainers are the treasure of Paldea. 
and amid that treasure, champions are the jewels that shine brightest. Champion Sammy, it is now your duty to set an example for all the all of the trainers of Paldea. Now allow me to walk you back to the entrance. Certain you'll find a familiar face awaiting you. Let me guess, Nimona. Gee, how'd I guess? Sammy, Sammy! Oh man, I can tell just looking at you. You did it, right? You became a champion. Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha, knew it all along. I got word from La Primera when you cleared the elite test. Oh man, Sammy, I'm a champion, and now you're a champion. Which means we're true equals. You and me, both champion-ranked trainers. This is amazing. Now that you made it here, I've got one thing to say. So you and me be best rivals for life. Yeah. Yes, Tomaya! All right, you know what rivals do? Battle their absolute hearts out. Hit you with everything this time. You ready? Do wait a moment, Champion Nimona. Huh? What's the matter, Primera? The champion assessment has only just ended. I believe arrest is in order for Champion Sammy, Palafin, and the others. Champions must be understanding toward their opponent. Eh, right. Here I go getting overexcited again. Sorry, Sammy and Palafin. I also must ask, is this roadside really the setting you two want for your first battle as true equals and rivals? Hmm. I think you mentioned it. That's a good point. In that case, can we use one of the Pokemon League battle courts? Surely there's someone more fitting. A place with special meaning for you. For the two of you, perhaps. Special meaning, huh? Hmm. Let me see. Any more leap to mind, Sammy? Up behind your house? <laughs> our beach out back, huh? Yeah, the place where you had our first battle might work. But on the other hand, to me, it's just kind of my backyard, you know? A little ordinary. Any place else come to mind? The treasure eatery. Mesa Goza? Mesa Goza? Ooh, good call. Place where you set out on a journey. That reminds me, Sammy. Remember back when Director Clavel explained the treasure hunt? You know how he told us to go in search of our own treasure? Well, I know what I well, I know what treasure I got out of all this. I found a true rival. Someone who could stand up to me at my full capabilities. That's right, I mean you. So glad I got to meet you, Sammy. Anyway, that being said. I'll be waiting for you at the battle court in Mesa Goza Central Plaza. See you there. Well, seems we got one more fight before I can end this episode. Respect you two share is palpable, even a bit enviable, to be honest. I am known as La Primera, but even when facing me in the final test of her champion assessment, Champion Nimona didn't reveal her full might. In you, I suspect she has found someone she can battle without holding anything back. Battle Nimona. That works. Stop by the center first. Yep. You need a rest? I'd like to heal my Pokemon. Any second now. Ah! There you are, Sammy. Ready for a battle between champions? So all these folks around here seem ready to watch. Word got around, I guess. Out of every single person gathered here. 
I'm the most excited by a mile. Stage is set. My all-out power. Versus your strength in full fruition. See who comes out on top. We're challenged by champion Nimona. Opening up with Lycanroc. Finally, the thing I've waited all this time for. And begin our greatest battle of all. Start with a flip turn. Ooh, didn't take him out. I think that I helped teach you tight matchups. Now you're using him to put the hurt on me. You like in rock. If it's pure rock, which means best bet would be to go with Kingsley. Even if I'm only gonna need one hit. Oh, you sneaky some bitch. Alright. It was ye old iron head. Ow! I do like my real hard hits. And it feels good to finally let loose. All right, who's next? Pomot. That sounds like a job for Tom. I thought it was immune. Ow! No, I'm just lucky he hasn't been frozen yet. Orthworm. That is, I believe, a ground type. Ground st or is this steel type? It was a steel titan, right? Yeah, the other one was the quaking earth titan. Now let's see if it's super effective anyway. Just regular effective. Okay. Hit it hard then. Still alive. Nope. Meant to do a jet punch there. Okay, still up. The Dunsparce. Bring Mr. Pink out. Critical moment. It was beyond luck. Got some kind of gift. Damn it. Okay, good news, all I need is one hit. Nice. Uh, too bad I don't have a priority. Don't need it. Okay. All right, what's next? Out Gudra. Grass won't work. Oh, 
Okay. Gonna heal up Mr. Pink. Hope he survives long enough for a U-turn. I'm gonna wanna free swap into Delfino. You may want to switch it to Kingsley. Try the Kowtow, Kalee, see what happens. Ooh, almost one hit. Missed again. Mouscarada. Battle of the starters. Which means it's terrestrializing time. It's all down to this. My last Pokemon. Gonna fight with everything we've got. Shine blazingly bright, my greatest treasure. I win! She lost. Legit incredible! You're the strongest out there, Sammy. You knocked me flat. Now I was giving you absolutely everything I had. Everything I. I. <laughs> oh man, Pokemon battling, am I right? So much better. So much more fun than I ever even knew. Thanks for that incredible match. I didn't get to read the rest of that. Now let's give ourselves a minute and have a quick break, Sammy, for round two. You're just like, what? Which Pokemon should I bring out this time? Decisions, decisions. Victory Road. Complete. Yep. One second. Yo, Arvin here. Bork. Whoa, town boy. Don't jump up like that. 
Seems like hearing your boy. Bleh. Seems like hearing your voice is all my boss stuff here all worked up, Sammy. Oh, but that's not why I called. Nearly forgot. Remember what we talked about before? About going to Area Zero? Of course you do. Little know-it-all. Got a mind like a steel trap, eh? Well, all the effort you've been putting in around Paldea has really helped you make a name for yourself. Built up some goodwill, that's for sure. I've been able to secure two allies who want to go to Area Zero with us. I should have us ready to tackle anything. So now we've all just got to get there. First up, we'll be gathering at Area Zero. I'll be waiting at the Zero Gate. I'll be ready and waiting at the Zero Gate. I'll send you the location on your phone, too. Don't leave me hanging forever. We'll be waiting. Bork, bork. And we'll be heading to the Zero Gate next time. Thank you all so much for joining me. If you liked this video, leave a like and a comment. If you want to see more, hit subscribe and the bell, and I'll see you guys next time.